taking a shower and I was, you know, getting ready to go in. I'm like, oh, wow, boobs, you're cold. You want to hop in the shower with me? Like, yes, oh, that'd be lovely. I'm like, okay, yeah. And so, so I started my day off thinking about boots. And I was wondering, you know, I don't, I don't talk enough to my boobs. Yeah, they sit there and they hide under clothes all the time, you know. The enemy has fled, abandoning the area. As our forces move up, they must exercise great care. Every object is a possible booby trap. You're not sucking daddy's dick when, you know, for sustenance when you're a child. No, no. But, you know, boobs, boobs are different. Like, it's, it's their special or something, because, you know, you, you nurse from them. You're lashed onto that titty. You're going, feed me, bitch. And when you fall asleep at night, you say your prayers to your deity of choice. You say, dear deity of choice, please don't let my teeth grow in. Eh, yeah, wish the hell you'd shut up. <laughs> Could this be one of them there booby traps? Mm, could be. I start wondering why do we do this? You know, boobs are friendly people most of the time. You know, sometimes they get like torpedoes and stuff, but those are like terrorist boobs. You know. Just watch out for the terrorist nipples. <laughs> Boobs are free, everything's free, it's a great time. about no booby traps. <laughs> 